नमस्कार वेलकम टू कलाम आई एस दिस इज वासुदेव सिंह भाटी हैव यू एवर नोटिस दैट देर आर लॉट ऑफ एस्पिरेंट्स हु एक्सेल इन दिस सेक्शनल टेस्ट व्हेन दे आर गिविंग द सेक्शनल टेस्ट ऑफ द पॉलिटी ऑफ द हिस्ट्री ऑफ द ज्योग्राफी ऑफ द एनवायरनमेंट दे आर स्कोरिंग अबाउ 100 कंसिस्टेंटली 110 120 इवन आई हैव सीन एस्पिरेंट्स स्कोरिंग 150 प्लस आल्सो स्पेशली इन पॉलिटी एंड हिस्ट्री बट एट द सेम टाइम दीस एस्पिरेंट्स व्हेन दे गो टू द रियल एग्जाम इट इज अ टोटली डिफरेंट बॉल गेम एंड इन द रियल एग्जाम there is a disaster now why uh, they face disaster in prelims even after scoring so well in the sectional test so uh, after uh, analyzing and uh, talking about uh, talking to all the aspirants we have come to conclusion that there are certain strategic mistakes that all the aspirants make now what are these strategic mistakes so the first one is they ignore the pyqs so all the aspirants what they are doing is they are solving questions but they are solving questions of only coaching institutes and they are not even looking at the pyqs so pyqs has to be central part of your prelims preparation and mains preparation strategy always second mistake that they do is there is over reliance on sectional test now what does it mean is they are giving 20 25 and 30 sectional test but after that uh, they are giving only 5 7 or 10 full syllabus test only so what happens is the mind is preparing you differently uh, so it brings to uh, our next problem that is time gap in the revision now what happens is when you over rely on the sectional test is you have prepared for one week you have prepared for polity and you appear for the text sectional test of polity then you prepare for modern history then you appear for sectional test of modern history so similarly you go on continuing uh, you know environment history uh, there is geography uh, economy and uh, once you have completed all the syllabus you have already forgotten what you read in the you know uh, one month or two months back so what happens is there is a huge time gap in the revision and it affects the overall preparation of the aspirant but whereas in the real exam only uh, subjects from one subject uh, questions from one subjects are not asked they ask questions from all the subjects and the last and most important is lack of analysis now uh, everyone is solving question but they never analyze the test they never analyze what the mistakes they have made so uh, these strategic mistakes that the aspirants made uh, we have come at uh, kalam is with a new eclavia as uh, program the eclavia as program we try to resolve all these strategic mistakes and uh, you know ensure that uh, aspirants are ready for the prelims so what are the features of eclavia as in eclavia as the first thing that we are going to do is every day there is going to be one hour full syllabus test now there will be 50 questions in this test and this 50 questions will be from every part of your syllabus there there will be questions from economy there will be questions from polity there will be questions from history geography environment current affairs there will be questions from uh, you know static as well as there will be pyqs certain pyqs will also be included in this test and the current affairs will also be included in this test so every everything that the upsc asked in the in their you know actual prelims exam so uh, our one hour test will also be framed around a similar test next is uh, there will be five c set questions every day apart from the 50 questions of the uh, you know uh, static current affairs and pyqs there will be five c set questions and uh, apart from that we will also provide you case snippet 365 plus that is the one years of current affairs uh, complete current affairs uh, will be given to you and along with case snippet 365 plus so uh, overall uh, this will be a 40 days program in 40 days every day we are going to solve 55 questions and cumulatively we will solve more than 2000 that is 2200 questions in just 40 days of every subjects not just from one subject but for, but from every subjects so what how does this help the aspirant so the first thing that it does is that it trains your mind to excel in prelims now what happens is when we are giving the sectional test the our training of mind is very different when we give the sectional test we prepare for one subject for 5 6 7 days and then we write the test to that related to that subject what happens is uh, we do not understand okay uh, these things are very fresh in my mind and that is why i am scoring so well in the exam but in the real exam things are not always fresh in your mind so you have to recall what you read 5 6 months back in the real exam and that is why uh, you are not training your brain properly if you are relying on sectional test and uh, you know giving very limited full length test so uh, we will train your mind to excel in prelims and not just in test because our objective here is to clear upsc csc not just the test of the coaching institutes next is stay in touch with all subjects now 
if you are writing, uh, if you are solving questions, 50 questions every day related to all the subjects, you will never, uh, you know, go out of touch from any of the subjects. For example, if you have not read polity from past one and uh, one month or one and a half month, that does not mean that you should not be solving questions related to polity. Similarly, environment, geography, every subject, you are solving questions related to every subject every day. So, you stay in touch with all the subjects and uh, third is you understand and you learn how to switch mind from one subject to another. That is what you have to do in the exam also. There will be three questions from polity, then three questions from history, then one economy, then one uh, geography. So, uh, similarly, these tests will also be framed in certain uh, same manner only and uh, you will also learn to switch mind from one subject to the another and train your mind to you know appear in the prelims exam and not just a clear uh, test of the coaching institutes and apart from that uh, the last problem that we talked about is a lack of analysis for to, to solve that problem of lack of analysis Kalam IS has come up with unique self-assessment report SAR so what happens in SAR is we analyze uh, every student analyze self-analyze their own uh, performance uh, so this is how the SAR looks like uh, after the test, uh, you will have this SAR sheet with you and uh, in every, after every test you analyze, okay, how many questions were there which I did because of lack of knowledge, which I did not do with them or I did them wrong or how many questions were there where I made a silly mistake, I knew the answer but I took the wrong answer there. So similarly, you analyze every test and you quantify your performance and you quantify everything and you track everything and once you track everything, you know, okay, this much silly mistakes I made in this test. This much, uh, this much questions I did wrong because I did not have uh, enough information or enough knowledge about this particular question. So, uh, you know where do you lack and you prepare accordingly. So, analysis helps you to prepare uh, better for the actual prelims exam. So, uh, looking forward uh, to see you all in our Eclavia ACE program and uh, this is starting from the 4th of March 2024. There will be offline as well as online classes. Offline classes are in Delhi. And uh, the price is just rupees 499. So, in just rupees 499, you are getting 40 tests, uh, you know, of 50 questions each. That is equivalent to 20 full length tests. And uh, that too every day uh, and that too of every subject every day. So, uh, this is not only cheap, but it is also a very effective way to prepare for UPSC prelims. So, uh, we will uh, see you in our classes. Thank you very much.